Hi everybody and welcome to Wednesday's Maths Lesson. Right, so Mr Lake, this week we've been looking at data yep. and putting that information in a, we did it, we put it in a tally chart first, yep. didn't we, that, we that did, table. Yep. Then yesterday we put it into a bar chart. We did, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the same information. Yeah, presented in different ways though, yeah. yeah. Okay, so we're going to be looking at that again today. Now, here I have a question for you, Mr Lake. So, Let's read the question, right? Some children made this graph. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right, now let's look at this. Ah, it's all about the colour we like best. Yep. Okay. Okay, so we've got red, an orange, a blue, a green, and a yellow. Yep. Okay, and number of children there. Right. Okay. So it says, look at the graph. Which colour do five children like best? Okay. So let's look here. So we've got the numbers, so straight away, okay, well, let's find five. Yep. Okay, well, it's, well, this one likes five. Yeah, I was just thinking, um, it's not going to be a completely straight line, but if I just mark it on the board there so you can see. Yeah, okay. There's only one that goes up to five exactly. Yeah, right? the others, they're different numbers. So that one, that is yellow. Yellow. Yep. So our answer is yellow. That's it. That's all. That's basically all we're doing today. We're going to look at different charts, different graphs, and, and find out. Yeah. Okay. Here's our next question, Mr. Lake. Now, some children made a graph. Okay. So this is a pictogram. Mm, pictogram. It looks very. I'm looking at that. And I'm thinking it looks very similar to a bar graph, doesn't it? Yeah. It's what we did yesterday. yesterday. But they've got little cups there. Okay. Yeah. And it says here. This is an interesting way of presenting it. Different to how we did it yesterday. Yep. But number of cupfuls. And yep. instead of just doing a bar like we did, they've got different cups. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So which container holds most water? Okay. So it's going to be the, the kind of biggest bar. The, yeah. The biggest number of cups. Straight away, right? That's the most, isn't it? Yeah, that? absolutely. Yeah. So let's look down. So that's the teapot. Yep. Because you've got a jug, a teapot, a bottle, and a carton. Well, the teapot has the most, holds the most, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, teapot, so answer. I mean, we could put six, six isn't it? So six cupfuls, if we want to put extra information. Okay. Now, here's our next question How many more cups? does the teapot hold than the jug? Right, well let's find the teapot, right? But right, teapot's a six, isn't it? Yeah, but the answer isn't six, because no. I know for what some people would then say six, there we yeah. go, because it holds six. But that's not what it's asking, is it? How many more cups does the teapot hold than the jug? Okay, so let's look at the jug, right? Here's the jug, so the jug is... Right, yeah, should we mark that as well? Right, so the jug has got four. Well, look, there's the, the jug goes up to that bit. Let's just put, so, one, two, it's two more, isn't it? Yeah. Just two Six more. Six is two more than four. Yeah. yeah. So, two more. And that's yeah. it. Okay. So, we've got lots and lots, got lots of questions like this today. Okay, we've got the mild ones in your resource pack. Okay. I would like everyone to do the mild ones. So, we've got different kinds of pictograms and charts and graphs. Okay. And then if you're feeling good at, and you're enjoying this, I think a lot of you will find this quite easy, actually. Um, if you're feeling really comf confident with this, please do the spicy ones. And we've got some other charts and graphs here for you to have a go at. So have fun and please send in your work.